Okay. Hold on. Cause Periscope fell off. So let me write the topic. <laughs> okay. And today, <laughs> face us. Okay. Yeah, nigga, typing skills, you know what I'm saying? I didn't even have to go to computer class for that shit, nigga. But yeah. So, yeah. I want to finish my message that I was trying to say earlier. So, talk like... All you bitch-ass niggas in, in the... Uh, Nigga, you're a cat. You're a little cat. You're a little tiny little cat. Shut the fuck up. But yeah, anyways. To all you niggas in in every black neighborhood that to all you bitch ass, whack ass niggas. <laughs> With no swag. Who 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 try to use, oh, I'm a street nigga, I'm a, I'm a street nigga, as an excuse to get by in life. Bruh, just, just stop. Stop, stop trying to, like, oh, I'm a hood nigga, I'm from the hood, yeah, woo. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a hood nigga. Just, like, cause, just because you ain't got no swag don't mean you ain't got to lie and tell people you a, you a gang, you a street nigga, you this, you, you, you do this and that and that. Bro, just stop it. Just, you ain't got no swag, fam. And don't get mad at the black rock stars because we, we, we doing us. We winning. We spread positivity. Boom, boom, boom. Stop trying to hate, bro. Like, we all black at the end of the day. We all trying to be successful at the end of the day, so what's the issue? I mean, just because you, you mad because you trying to be somebody you're not, and the black rock stars are being themselves spiritually, they're being true to themselves, and you, and, and you want to be street niggas, or, or, or I got the Draco, I got the Draco, I got the 30 clip, boom, boom, boom. Nigga, shut the fuck up, nigga. If you, if you niggas... If you niggas not in Chicago or like LA or like Detroit with that with that shit, shut the fuck up, bro. Cause it's really going down in like them cities for real, bro. It's really going down, lot like it's really going down over there, bro. Like if y'all niggas really wanna be street, if y'all niggas really wanna go to war with niggas so bad, go to go to them cities, bro. Yeah, go to New Jersey. Like, go to them city. Like, go where it's really going down now, for real. Like, don't, don't be, don't, don't, don't be in, like, don't be in, like, a, a quiet community where it's, like, civilized and you still talk about you on some savage shit. You trying to, you about whatever. You will take a nigga. Like, no, go, go where it's going down now. Now, don't get it twisted. 
South Florida, Miami, Broward, Palm Beach. Nigga, it goes down. But I'm going to tell you, nigga, something. It's only going down because you niggas want it to go down. But it's places where it's really rough. It's rough for real. The houses is ran down. The community is poor. Everything. Miami, it goes down, but it's, it, it, only, it only goes down. South Florida, it goes down all the straight up. It's on some ego shit. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's ego. As far as the the, lick, the living condition, as far as the living condition in in Florida, South Florida, it's it's not bad. So stop it. I don't get it twisted. Florida niggas, we not pussy. We'll take your life. Boom. But at the end of the day, it's no reason for niggas to be acting like we poor. Because it's, it, we, niggas is not poor. Niggas is not... Niggas is not poor in Florida, bro. It's it's not... Like, the setting of Florida is not bad. Like, it's, it's, it's not bad. So, you know, for niggas in Florida, we act like... that. Like, the setting, the houses, and the... It's ran down and abandoned and all this... this nigga, stop it. Just cut that shit out. Stop it, bro. Stop it. Miami, dog, every hood in Miami look like the suburbs now. So, cut it out. All right? Niggas in L.A., you don't see niggas in L.A. still trying to act like they don't menace to society. Nigga, L.A., they cleaning L.A. up. They fixing L.A. up. Boom. Y'all niggas want to go, go to Detroit, bro. Like, go, go to, like, shit, go to, like, go to, like, shit like that. I wouldn't even mention New York. New York, New York shouldn't even be trying to turn up. New York just, New York should be chilling. Because New York got it good. As far as, like, the the connections New York have and all the shit that y'all get, that New York get, they should be chilling up there. I've been, I, I seen Cleveland, Cleveland, Cleveland. That shit look kind of fucked up, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. It just look like some regular hood shit, but it just still look like, it still look kind of fucked up. But as far as like, but, if, but come on, dog. Florida, y'all gotta do better, bro. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas doing too much. Niggas doing too much. Niggas trying too hard. Niggas, niggas trying to act like they came from nothing. Like fuck, nigga, you stay in a yellow house. Niggas in, like niggas, niggas in Florida be living in like yellow, pink, orange, purple houses and shit. I tell about, bro, I came from the trenches. Nigga, shut the fuck up, nigga. The only reason why niggas in Florida is, is we mad because there's a lot of fuck niggas doing fuck nigga shit. And, you know, it's just like niggas getting fed up with that shit. Dallas ain't got no reason to be crazy, though. Dallas is a good city. I like Dallas. But nigga, Detroit. Detroit is poor right now. They got every reason to be angry for I understand niggas be broke. Well Florida people in Florida I don't get I never understood why people from my state is just like fucked up. Because like I said, people in Florida don't have a reason to be like that. 
I don't know why people in Florida are like that. Because Florida is, people in Florida are evil as fuck. And I don't know why, bro. The women in Florida are trash. The niggas in Florida act like bitches. So, I don't know. All I know is that if you go to Florida, just try your hardest to mind your business and stay out the way. Just be safe because Florida's cursed, bro. But, you know, as far as the the black community goes, um, the black community, like I said, Yeah, the Haitians, I'm, I'm going to tell you something about the Haitians, dog. I'm going to be real with you. I really need the Haitians to listen to this shit. If you Haitians feel like y'all ain't got shit to lose and y'all feel like y'all untouchable and all this shit, go to Detroit. That's all I'm going to say, bro. Because, see, I'm going to tell you something. The last time niggas in Florida was wilding out like that is when niggas was... Killing each other over coke and all that, over drugs and all that shit. But Like I said, to, to you Haitians, bro, that, that really think that y'all can't be touched, dog, like, for some reason, because I don't have hatred towards Haitians or Jamaica, like, we all black, but for some reason, it's like, I know people hated it on Asians a lot back then, but it's like, at this point, y'all came a long way, bro. Y'all ain't got nothing to prove no more. Y'all already proved y'all selves in the 90s. Y'all already proved y'all selves in the early 2000s. What, what y'all doing? Because it's really, y'all the only niggas out here doing dumb shit, to be honest. And, and to be real with you, um, if y'all really feel like y'all can't be touched, on some, on some street shit. Go to Detroit. That's all I'm going to say. Because every time I see Haitians, y'all claim y'all be extorting niggas from out of town when they go to Florida. But why extort them? Why don't y'all go to war with these with these gangs, with these real niggas from other cities like Chicago, Detroit, and all that? Like, go to war with them. Don't, don't try to befriend them. Nah, go to war with them. And, and see how long y'all last. So, you know, to all the black rock stars and all the black communities, don't stop following your dreams. Don't give up. Don't let these haters in your neighborhood stop you from being a black rock star that you want to be. Always watch your back. And, um... I, I didn't, I'm not going to let them stop me from being the best black rock star I, I am, never. I, I I used to live a certain type of lifestyle, and that's what I lived in the past. You know, I used to do wild shit, you know, I used to hang with niggas, you know, we used to do wild, boo, boo, talk kind, blah, 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 fight a hundred niggas, at, you know, in the park a lot, shoot, shoot the fight up, everybody run, pop, 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 you know, shit like that. Drive bars, all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But what? But how much money did that get me? That ain't get me no money. When I got older, I started doing what I love. So don't, don't, don't let these, don't let these, 
don't let these, just because y'all see all these street rappers coming back out, niggas, you know, dog, don't let these niggas manipulate y'all into trying to be like them. Be yourself. That's all I'm saying. Be yourself, bro. If you're not from the streets, it's cool. Be yourself. Look at our future. Our future showed y'all that y'all can be yourself without trying to be hard, bro. You ain't got to try to act tough. You ain't got to be jealous of the next person to be successful. You ain't got to lock the next person. You ain't got to kill the next person because they better than you. Just be yourself, bro. And the right girl gonna find you. Don't try to holler at another nigga girl because you jealous of him because he got the girl you wish you had. She obviously not the one for you. But when you be yourself, the right woman gonna find you. She gonna come to you, bro. Yeah, Yes, this is real life. This is not the internet. The internet was made for us to spread a message. That's it. But this is real life, bro. So like I said, all you niggas in the neighborhood, in the black communities, knocking these young black rock stars for being they self, y'all niggas is cowards. Y'all niggas is not no real street niggas. Because real street niggas would acknowledge that. Just how Snoop Dogg acknowledged for real. Straight up. Snoop Dogg did a song with Pharrell. And look how it came out. A Crip nigga did a song with a black rock star. That shit came made a classy the other. Syringe. Shout out to Syringe. Black rock star, bro. So, at this point, to all you dudes, you know, who claim y'all want to be, you know, y'all from the streets and all that, y'all goons and savages, I see you, you know, but don't say you a savage and you a goon if you don't want to see the next next black man be himself, because that ain't, that ain't savage. Savages ain't even got time to sit there and worry about what the next thing is doing anyway. Real savages get their own money. And real savages go to war with real savages. So, I'm gonna forever be a black rock star, bro. And to all you lame ass niggas in Florida that don't wanna see black men change their life for the better and be themselves. I don't fuck how bad you get. You a bitch in my eyes. You a bitch. You ain't got no swag, bro. That's all that is. So. Yeah. I'm gonna holler at y'all. We out here.